Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So a couple of months ago, Google added a Manage Passkeys button in the Google Chrome's Password Manager, which we can get to by heading up to our main menu, clicking on Google Password Manager, and in the Settings page, um, as part of the Password Manager, yeah, you'll see Manage Passkeys. So that's the button that was added a couple of months ago. Now, just a quick recap on what pass keys are all about and because it does uh, correlate with today's video and just in case you're unaware. A pass key works very similar to two-factor authentication. But as an example, instead of sending a code to your phone, you provide a biometric verification such as a fingerprint or facial scan uh, that um, is more resistant to online attacks like phishing. So that's just a quick overview as to what pass keys is all about. And by the way, I did post a video on how you can create pass keys for your Google accounts um, back in May of this year. And I'll leave that down below because it ties in with what we're talking about today. Now, getting back to this pass keys button. Now, previously, this manage pass keys, if you clicked on it, it took you over and led you to the Chrome pass keys page in the actual browser. Now, believe it or not, um, the Google Chrome web browser and the recent Moment 4 feature update for Windows 11 22H2 are actually interlinked. Because after uh, the recent Moment 4 feature update that rolled out earlier this week, which was KB5030310, if you click on this button now, what it does is after updating to Moment 4, this button now takes you directly to the passkey section of the settings app in Windows 11. So if you click on that, just to demonstrate, there we go. So you can now manage your passkeys directly from the settings page, and that's part of the accounts passkeys page in the settings app of Windows 11 version 22H2. And it says, uh, use the passkeys saved on this device to sign into apps and websites without a password. Instead, sign in using your face fingerprint or PIN, as mentioned, through Windows Hello. So um, Google Chrome and the Moment 4 update are actually interlinked. And I just wanted to bring this to your attention because obviously this is a bit of a security enhancement and a bit of a security improvement. And in case you're unaware, just um, keeping you updated and in the loop. So passkeys now um, takes you directly to that passkeys page, which I'm um, rolled out after updating to Moment 4. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.